Hi my dear gorgeous besties, I hope you're doing good. Welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Lifestyle Major. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, I literally appreciate you so much. So, this is a travel vlog and I am so happy to be vlogging this moment for y'all. It's been a while since I popped in here and dropped a vlog. So I was like, since I'm traveling, why not create a meaningful or rather a cute video or rather a moment for y'all, so yeah so initially this trip was supposed to happen last week but there was some tussle and bustle here and there so we didn't get to book the trip today is on 29th of uh, january to where mombasa ah, i'm about to bikini y'all i'm about to bikini y'all i'm about to bikini this body on y'all you know one thing about about me i'm a bikini designer i'm a bikini model so anything with bikinis anything concerning water Babe, you know, I'm the girl for that. So, yep. This is gonna be my first time to Mombasa because normally I'm always just in uh, Diani or uh, Malindi. And uh, I've only passed in Mombasa once and I haven't even stayed. I haven't even experienced like 30 minutes in Mombasa. So, I'm so curious to see the environment and the vibration, what the whole situation gives. And we did our research where we're gonna be staying the whole red eye disease is not there so i just pray that god goes before us in this journey and so yep if i get to catch the camera and share some moments i will otherwise the people that i'm associating with and hanging out with i don't even want to be in front of the camera and i do not want to make them feel uncomfortable but i'm gonna try as much as i can to be able to give you a meaningful moment and i'm gonna catch you guys later otherwise i hope you're doing good i hope you are amazing and i literally appreciate you all so much so without talking too much my dears so I bought this Garnier Skin Active Hydro Balm. I'm literally gonna use it the minute I travel and I reach. I'm gonna use it. If not, I'm gonna use it tomorrow morning. Then I also bought the Oraimo charger for iPhone because mine, something happened. Then we have this Luron nail polish. Honey, we're speaking summer vibes around here. Blue, 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 blue. And also on top of that, some chewing gums to keep the girl's mouth busy so yeah my dear see ya you say it's hard to tell just what i'm thinking you think it's hard to see Behind my smile I'll say whatever you want Let you walk in on my heart If you want to You can ask Anything no walls between us Ain't no mess I'ma tell you all my secrets You can ask Anything no walls between us Ain't no mess I'ma tell you all my secrets No secrets
it's hard to see behind my smile I'll say whatever you want Let you walk in on my heart if you want to and so I'm just so intrigued I'm literally so intrigued by how fast this town is growing I never knew like it has all these beautiful incredible apartments like damn the apartments that I'm seeing right now baby they are motivating so if you ever feel like you want to invest in Mombasa have an Airbnb or rather have own a house literally this part is giving so I'm in Nyali and uh, yeah the vibes I'm in the elevator because babes I'm looking so so stick fire like don't play with the girl she a butt one you know the vibes so yeah I'm gonna catch my camera and uh, give you all the moments if I feel like there's anything to vlog otherwise it's just all chill calm vibes and uh, yeah <music>
the ice behind my stone cold eyes I turn the ashes but only just sometimes Inhale your smoke but you still act surprised It's not my fault when we end up capsized You call me crazy now but you don't understand I'm calling out to you Can you hear a thing? Cause you lit the match That ignites the flame I'm the TNT But you're the spark to blame And it's fire Burning holes inside my brain Feel the fire Keep the melters down again Now it's pouring through my veins But I said you're the spark to blame And it's fire Burning holes inside my brain Hi lovers, it's quite of a beautiful, incredible day. The sun is out, the heat is literally hitting, and we was like, why don't we go to the beach? You know, since this is my last day here, I was like, why not go experience some mood and some vibes in the beach? This is gonna be my first time, and honey, I'm psyched up. So let's go, buddy, let's go experience the sun, the vibes, the mood, and baby, I'm down for it. Well, at least we're professional. Jumbo jet, where? The last time we did a jumbo jet. Mimi, we need Mimi, raha yangu iko na specifications. Kuna specifications ingine afana.
back to my channel it's a guy from lifestyle major if you're new here welcome 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 if you are a returning subscriber i usually appreciate you so much so it's been a while since i took my phone and um i vlogged and you know i just i don't know it's just because of being confused on what kind of content i want to share if i literally want to share stuff about my life you see and all that because sometimes it becomes so overwhelming and you draining because you don't want to come out as though you're showing off or trying to do you know something that's discouraging someone you know you want to show something that's motivating fun and entertaining so i've been a bit confused i wasn't sure what i wanted to do it to see and all that so um uh, it's been a while it's been a while i think since december i haven't vlogged so the whole of december and i think even some months before that because the last vlog that I posted was a vlog must day one and that was it. I tried capturing uh, some moments when I went to Nyali, still I was not in the vibe and I was like, damn, what's going on? I wanted to create travel vlogs and there I was in, and, and I was in Nyali and um, I couldn't be able to share the content and all that. And I was like, what's literally going on? So I had to like sit down, pray a bit about it. So that i can go back to the motivation you know sometimes you pray and ask god you want to do something then certain starts coming with some situations to derail you to make you feel lazy and all because i told god i want to go move out and stay on my own like me on my own so that i'm able to create content and that happened and then boom i start feeling lazy i start questioning if i really want to do this and um, when i was yearning for this moment I was literally yearning for it you know like when i needed to create such kind of content i was literally you know like i was yearning to create such kind of content and so i'm like i had to pray over it and about it and um, i'm glad i made up my mind and i'm glad um i have the motivation so yeah without talking too much it's been a while like like honestly i haven't been in my house for a whole month I left my house on 29th of January, traveled to Nyali, came back. Again, I had to leave again for some um, work that I was supposed to do around um, Narok slash Kitengela. Then I came back and honestly, the moment I was coming back, it was like nighttime. I pick my stuff and I go. I come and I go. So I haven't stayed in this house. And then after that, I went to my mom's place. Because I had not uh, been with her for such a long time because when the new year started I just saw her for some days and then I came here I think for a week then I came back to my place so I was like I want to spend my t some time with my mama so I went and uh, stayed with her when I was done with my parents and so I came back yesterday was 26th of February today is 27th of February so today I would say is my first day in my house this february and it just feels different like honestly i never knew i was gonna miss my house you know i never knew when i'm gonna sit here and i'm just like oh my gosh i miss my house the same way you can miss going to a place the same way you can miss um someone or something i miss my house i was like damn i miss my house i want to be in my house i miss my white curtains i miss my big mirror i just miss moving around my little gorgeous house even though i haven't fully finished it this house just gives me peace it makes me feel content it makes me feel happy and all so yeah so since i haven't been here for a month i want to do a lot of cleaning i reach out to my cleaning lady she's uh, not available till friday and honey i'm not sitting in the house till friday to wait you know so i'm gonna do some one two three things that i know i'm gonna be able to do the ones that i know it's gonna be tough and hard i'm gonna wait for her to come and do it on friday but uh the sweeping the uh, mopping and just dusting some utensils that's what i'm gonna do and also just arrange the dressing room plus my bedroom i also need to change the sheets so those are the things i'm gonna do i also need to call the mama Fua guys the laundry people to come and pick my white duvet so that they can be able to wash it and yeah I'll be about my business so i just wanted to grab the camera so to y'all say hello hey what's up and catch up with y'all then it's been a while otherwise i hope you're doing great thank you so much for the patience thank you so much for the love thank you so much for the motivation and thank you for those who reached out to me and asked me hey kiki what's up why are you not creating content i literally appreciate you all so much it gave me the motivation to keep trying and keep pushing so yeah otherwise guys let me start with 
whatever I want to do otherwise if I don't start right now I'm gonna be lazy and I don't want that so um, first things first I just woke up uh, like a few minutes ago my water has been uh, brought I had ordered for water from the Aquamist guys near where I stay yesterday evening when I arrived but uh, they delivered today morning so I've just done the payment now I want to brush my teeth as the tea is uh, cooking and all that then I read my Bible and get into the whole cleaning vibration so yes guys I hope you're doing great and I hope this vlog is gonna be given otherwise I love you and I appreciate you so much Mwah. Ah, I'm so excited I hope you are excited too Because I was here and there and all that so I didn't feel the need to capture all that so yeah otherwise I hope you're doing great and I hope you're doing good I feel good ah I got another more for mm, mm, mm. it's the little things that make you so excited and happy when you when you when you keep growing you know <laughs> never in my life did I ever think that I'll be so excited because I have a new mopper, you know? The other time when I was hosting my cousin here, she broke my mopper and she's such a little kid. She's still in class six and she was like, I'm gonna get you another mopper, don't worry when my mom gets me one. And I'm like, babes, no, 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 no. It won't make me feel good. So it's okay, mistakes happen and we learn from them. And so, yeah, so I didn't see the need. And uh, since I've been up and down, I didn't, uh, since when she was here, I've been up and down and I haven't been in the house Meaning I didn't get the chance to buy the mopper. So it's when I purchased it yesterday and Yes, the girl has a new mopper for the house and I'm so excited Mwah. So let me unbox the stuffs that I bought and then uh, we can call it a day <laughs> So um, I purchased one kg of beans. I love beans so much, and uh, I purchased um, 
one kg of sugar. That's, I don't know why they say this is white sugar and it looks brown. Is it dirty? I don't know. I don't know. I get disturbed anytime I see such kind of stuff. Then I also bought six eggs. I bought the kara coconut milk. Ooh. So I bought the kara coconut milk and I bought four sachets of uh, long life milk. Um, uh, normally I love purchasing the box which usually has 12 um, packets uh, of uh, milk but right now I just wanted to buy something that's gonna hold me on because normally I do my monthly shopping around 7th or 8th of every month and so I feel like I still have like some few days before I reach that so I was like let me just get some one to three things that I need in the house because when I left the house, I did not leave a lot of food in the house. I still have some food left in the house, but I just stocked a little bit of it. Till 8th, that's when I'll be adding now. That's when I'll be doing major shopping. I love doing that because I get to keep check of my spending. So yeah. So this time I want to try out something different. Normally I usually use the liquid uh, soap for washing. This time I want to try this one. It smells so, so good. So this is what I'm gonna try use. I literally like it. Okay, let me not say I literally like it because I haven't used it yet, but I think it smells good. And then, guys, let me just check the receipt. So can you imagine these two kitchen rolls were going for 132? I don't know. Mm, oh yeah, it's because of the size. It's because of the size. The ones that I usually buy are usually a bit thick. I wanted to tell you this is a huge deal, but then I was like, mm. I look at the size. And I was like, nah. But if I think it's still gonna carry me through um, the first week and the second week of uh, March, but still, when I'm doing the full shopping, the monthly shopping, I'm still gonna get more of this because. I use kitchen towels a lot. I use them to wipe my hands. I use them to wipe the surface. I just use them a lot. Sometimes I never even I never even understand why I like misuse them in that kind of manner. So yeah, yeah, that's how small it is. But either way, the other four hundred and thirty-two shillings, I think that's fair. Because normally I usually buy them at one hundred and ninety-five or one hundred and eighty something, depending with the brand. And so yeah, I think that's gonna run me through for a while. And yeah, as usual, the big girl toss. I need this because my cleaning lady is coming tomorrow to do some cleaning in the house and also to wash some clothes. And so I'm sure she's gonna need this. I don't want to, she reaches here and then I have to send her to the supermarket or I'm the one who has to go to the supermarket. I don't like that. So I bought this because um, she can use that and it smells so good it smells so good by the way lavender toes guys 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 i think these people should give me these people should give me an opportunity to be their brand ambassador because the amount of times i've introduced people to this soap <laughs> watch her too i know my time will come and so i also bought rosie the shower um the hand wash it's a hand wash cream slash soap um the one that i used in my um the sink the one that i usually place on the sink near my bathroom is over and so this is for that for the kitchen i'll purchase when when i'm doing the monthly shopping because it's still like almost halfway so i didn't feel the essence of adding that i also added four pieces of uh, tissue because i'm still gonna do a monthly shopping and so i did not want to waste my money i love being there once in a while to just shop for these things and so yeah so yeah guys that's what i bought let me put all these things in one place then i have my tea and i know what i'm gonna eat literally i can't believe it I have i can't believe that i haven't eaten lunch but it's been like that for like the last um the last one month the last one month Mm, the last two weeks I think I haven't been eating lunch and I don't know why but I need to go back to that because if I want my body to pick up so fast then I have to make sure I eat my lunch and I also add some snacks to eat otherwise I've been slacking I'm doing so much and I'm eating less food and I don't want that so yep 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 so guys let me have my coffee 
or rather tea depending with what I'll, I want then after that I'll go to that restaurant that usually makes some good food I order my dinner if not I'll make a call because it's drizzling outside right now if I feel lazy because of that I'm just gonna make a call and uh, they'll deliver the food and uh, yeah easy peasy life honey who doesn't like that who does not like that again another thing imagine i broke my um coffee machine i was washing it and then i just knocked it so bad and i was like oh my god so it broke and it broke at the wrong spot and so i couldn't use it anymore and at the same time i was so scared that maybe the glass particles might be in the drink which is very dangerous so Yep, I gave uh, the other remaining part away and so I need to get another one. I need to get another one very, very soon. So I hope maybe when I'll be doing my monthly shopping, I'll get it. If not, I'm going to get it before I do the monthly shopping because honey, that's a necessity. I need it. The girl cannot survive without ground coffee because imagine... Uh, imagine... One... Two, three coffee waiting for me <laughs> yeah so the minute i bought it and then boom i broke it and i'm just feeling so bad and this one i bought it i think um start of january i bought it because i was so curious i just want to try it this is my first time it's going to be my first time trying this normally i usually take this one east african blend from java all of them are from java and i'm so curious to test the arabica how it tastes and I also saw some in the supermarket and I want to buy more, but I can't keep buying more when I don't have the coffee machine. So as soon as I buy it, the better or else my coffee is just going to get wasted here for no reason. So, yep, guys, let me store these things. Then I'll catch you guys later. to go buy dinner from the restaurant I usually tell you about so I bought some pilau and some shawarma it's the this is gonna be my first time testing their shawarma I did not know they were gonna put the sauce in I did not see so if I knew I would have told them not to because I don't like it when it's too soggy but anyway let's see how it's gonna be that's the kachumbari for my pilau and I also bought soda so that i can quench my thirst and make my meal interesting so yep let me just eat real quick as i watch some youtube videos and i'll catch you guys later
love so um i just want to fold my clothes and uh, place them in the closet because uh, today is more of kind of a, a chilled slash have to do something gay <laughs> so yeah so i just want to fold some clothes that were washed yesterday and um i'm also waiting for the rider to come and pick my duvet and some of the clothes that were hard to wash by hand so that they can be taken to mama for a laundry and um after that i just go about my business so the most important thing is to just uh fold these clothes make sure they're in the right place and um uh, yeah all that all that and then after that i eat my lunch i think i'm gonna go back to that place where they were selling um it's called what shawarma ah baby that shawarma slapped that shawarma slapped i just woke up and i felt like mm, i gotta eat something good what's that shawarma baby <laughs> yes so yep so let me fold my clothes and then after that i can go uh give myself give myself some good food and uh we'll see how the day goes by otherwise i hope you're doing great so during the day there was no electricity i don't know if it's because it rained yesterday the whole the whole night i think the whole night it rained the whole night because personally i remember i went to bed around one or two and it was still raining and i'm like oh my gosh this is just gonna be very chaotic so yep anyway i'm glad the electricity is back let me fold my stuff then i can see what else because i'm also supposed to type some minutes for a welfare association that i'm in and i'm supposed to forward it today because it needs uh they require it tomorrow uh for some whatever for some um there's something that I need to do tomorrow and so they require those minutes ah my gosh this is one good reason as to why i hate being an official in these groups you know mostly a secretary may don't like those stuff i think i, I would want to resign because babes who's gonna be typing all these things all the time every time it's just not my cup of tea it makes me feel like mm, not really so yeah anyway let me fold my stuff let me catch the talk and uh, let us do this so mwah.
fill my soul with light the day we met I don't wanna leave your side, no Have me by your side when the sun sets I hope you'll still want me, I hope you'll still need me A million years from now The seasons are changing, the night's ever fading It's time we left the ground Let's leave for an eternity We'll sail across the lights beyond the sky I'll be with you eternally I'm an addict for your love It keeps me high Keeps me high Why you keep on asking about my friend, boy? 
bust the tempo Ain't the game running through your tempo Bust down, bust down, ayy Don't complicate things, keep it simple Hold it down, hold it down, ay, ay. Love you like my family, we can't fold Love it when you smile
So my clothes uh, have just been picked up. They send a rider to come and pick the clothes and the duvet that I needed to be washed, that are uh, required to be washed. And uh, I've also finished uh, folding the clothes and arranging my closet. Goodness, I feel so good, I feel so good. There's that feeling when you get, when you realize that the house is intact, it's in place, it's looking nice, it's smelling good. So the only thing that's remaining is I want to mop because I don't know, I tend to just feel like I need to mop my house every day. I don't fucking understand. I don't understand why that happens almost on a daily. But um, I just feel like for my mind to be content and okay, I need to do to mop. That part of me was uh, thinking I should mop before I go to sleep so that I leave the house, uh, so that the house can dry up. And then it's easy for me to use because if I mop right now, it's gonna be so hard for me to move around from one place to another. So I think I'm gonna do that later on at night before I go to bed. I'll sweep, it's already clean, but I feel like I should just sweep to remove some little dust uh, here and there and also mop and uh, yeah, it can dry up while I'm sleeping. So I'm excited, the electricity is back. So right now I just wanna hop in the shower because uh, babes, cold water in me, we're no friends. So yeah, I just wanna hop in the shower. Then I go look for lunch. And then I type the minutes that I was saying. And after that, I can watch some YouTube videos to just relax, because babes, I'm so exhausted. I'm so, so exhausted. Then tomorrow, I also need to go to the university. I have a, me I have a meeting with my HOD, so let me see how everything goes for tomorrow. We're gonna sort it tomorrow. Let me why uh, let me wind up whatever I'm supposed to do today and uh, see how everything is gonna go. And I'm gonna catch you guys later. I hope you're doing great. I hope this vlog is vibing. And yep, I think I'll close this vlog tomorrow because I don't want it to be too long for no reason. And so yeah, guys, it feels so good. It feels so good to be back in front of the camera and vlogging. And I feel it's also high time I start using my camera and uh, allow my phone to relax. But I don't know, I find myself, I find it so easy to just put my phone there and start recording because uh, with the camera you have to, uh, when you finish, you have to transfer the content to the whatever, and I hate using the laptop to edit. I love using my phone because I can edit anywhere, whenever, you know, it's really easy and all that. So, yeah, guys, we can call it a day. Uh, today feels so successful because I feel like I've done a lot. But, and also when I clear this corner, because here I have some easy peasy clothes that I don't like them to be washed in the laundry, I feel like I can just be able to, like, do it myself or rather I can call the cleaning lady to come and sort these ones out so once I clear this ones here and I clear that there and also I have some here I have some here in this whatever here I, here I usually put the clothes that I'm not able to fold because my closets are too small and so it's not easy for me to like um, align to like arrange all of my clothes because I have the one in my bedroom and I have this one and they're too small I cannot be able to align everything so I want to add more storage in this room that's why I want this room to be my uh, dressing room so that I can be able to add more space for my shoes on this other side this other end I would love also some open shelves for those clothes in you know those clothes that look so mm, vibrant and cute and whatever I wanna display them here then the ones that I just feel like they're annoying me and they're irritating me or that I feel like they're kind of competing I'm gonna store them in this closet and the other closet in my bedroom so that's a project I'm supposed to do this year I'm not sure what time when because I have a lot that's going on but the most important thing right now it's my business and so yeah so guys i hope you're doing great and i'm gonna catch you guys later uh 
girls i hope you're doing great so i just finished typing my um minutes i've already submitted to the whatsapp group that i was supposed to submit so currently i'm just making a quick dinner because um i'm feeling like i need to make some food in the house today because tomorrow i'll be rushing out in the morning and anytime i'm rushing out in the morning i like having something cooked in the house so the food that i'm making right now i'm gonna use it today and tomorrow lunch and so yeah so i'm thinking of making some coconut beans and uh, rice and uh, some little vegetables so yeah guys i hope you're doing great and i hope this vlog is vibing so without talking too much i think i'm gonna close this vlog here today so I'm gonna catch you guys tomorrow when I'm starting a new vlog. This time I'm gonna push myself and make sure I'm I'm creating content back to back because I just miss vlogging. I miss content creating content and I wanna kill that fear. So yep. Give me some thumbs up, leave a comment below, share my videos, and thank you so much if you stay till the end to watch this vlog. I appreciate you so much. Till tomorrow. Ciao. Mm. Thank you.